All right, we're back with some core keeper and we are ready to fight the hive mother right up here. Uh, it looks like the acid is still there. I reinforced all my weapons, repaired everything. I made a bunch of food. Um, this will give me a range damage bonus for five minutes. That's great. And got a bunch of potions, healing potions. Um, I'm bringing my iron shovel to dig up the slime. I don't know if that's going to work. I got my hoe. I'm going to try that if the shovel doesn't work. Uh, because the slime is going to be a problem. I repaired my armor. Um, can we reinforce my armor? Yes, we can. This is uh, using up Oh boy. That's using up a lot of iron. Alright. Uh, do we have everything we need? Yeah, let's do it. We didn't do much damage last time. But, um... Do we have any bombs? Now, uh, what jewelry do we have? Life on melee hit. Uh, yeah, that'll be good. Maybe I can just stand up next to it and keep whacking it. If I can leech nearly as much health as I'm losing from standing in the acid, then uh, maybe it won't be too bad. Okay. 21 max health. Is there a better ring? Dodge chance. Thirteen armor. I'm gonna use this ring. I think thirteen armor is better than twenty one max health. All right, let's go. Uh, first of all, do we have any traits? Yes, let's spend our trait points. More ore, let's do that. Running. Ooh, 10% chance to dodge after standing still. This would be good if... Uh, let's... Does this effect stay if I'm attacking? Oh, it does. Okay, interesting. But I like more movement speed. I'm going to try this one. Um, the dodge chance after standing still. Melee attack speed. More max health. Ooh, 2% damage while at max health. 4% damage while at low health. Um, if I'm in a big epic fight, I, it's not likely I'm going to be at max health for long. So I'm, uh, I'm going with this one. All right, crafting. 4% chance to not lose durability when using tools and weapons. Oh, this is good. I'm taking that one. 2% range attack speed. Yep. More seeds. More food from cooked food. All right, I really got to do some more fishing. All right, let's do it. Let's uh, see how this goes. All right, we made it.
Let's uh, eat some food. We're just gonna go in and start whacking it, see what happens. Whack. Keep whacking. Vampire ring is saving my butt here. Oh, we got it. Yeah, this one. The three life on hit, that kept me alive. We got another Mordor, some ores, and the heart. I have mother chest. I want to try to dig up. Oh, we can. Sweet. Now, is this going to be useful? Probably not. How about this? Can we pick up this? Nah, we can't. Alright. Well, that went pretty well. Yeah, I guess, um... Don't bother using ranged weapons. Uh, ranged weapons... They... The cooldown is too high on the attack. I can't attack too often. Uh, often enough to do uh, significant damage... Uh, quickly. So... I say, my strategy... It's just go in there with a sword and just keep whacking it. Get that uh, vampire ring. The uh, clot ring. I don't remember where I got it, but find one of those and just keep whacking it till it dies. That is my pro gamer strategy. All right, we're back. Let's, uh, let's put this, uh, heart of the Hive Mother where it belongs, and we'll see what happens. That was the last one. Alright, we get any new recipes? Larva Spike Club. That is slightly better than the Iron Sword. It has a little knockback. Okay. Grub Zuka, 99 to 110, 119 range damage. That's the same as the Iron Bow. Although this has been uh, enhanced. Oh point seven attacks per second. Oh, it attacks much faster. And projectiles pierce. Okay, that's much better. Okay, hologram pad. A strange device that materializes spirits of the past. 
10 ancient gemstone, 10 mechanical part. Let's build it. Um, before we put it down, because I don't know what it's going to do. Let's um, look at this thing. It's an uh, eyeball. It's looking at me. Hi. Thou hast awakened us. Is that a good thing? Never have we seen such a creature as thee. There once was a thriving civilization here. But it seems all of it has been lost. We must have been dormant for eons. We wonder. We must ask something of thee. Seek the ancient titans still roaming beyond the Great Wall. Destroy them and collect their souls. With their energy, we can restore what once was. In return, thou shalt be able to go back to whence thou comest. By the power which, with which we now imbue thee, the great wall shall be opened as thou layest a hand upon it. We have become shiny. Okay, so the great wall that he's talking about is this outer wall, this impassable green wall out there. So maybe I can just go through it now? Or break it? Thou must travel far out to the great wall and lay a hand upon it to open it. The titans can be found beyond the great wall. I must travel. Okay. So presumably the next uh, tier ores can be found out there as well. All right, let's try this thing. Ancient hologram pad. What's a good place for a hologram pad? There's a little corner right here we can put it. Hey, buddy. Oh, hi. What are you... A crystalline egg-shaped object that will catch your eye even from large distances. Wow, that is expensive. Okay. I can't afford any of this. These are using bars. Scarlet bar, gal galaxite bar. Scan the world. Oh, okay. Oh, these are the Titans. Okay. I gotcha. Can I build any of these? Poison slime now. I think these all require materials that... That I will find it past the wall. Okay, so we can scan for the Titans. That'll show us where they are. That's awesome. Um, what else did I want to do? Uh, oh. I built this, um... Electronic... What is it? Electronic workbench? Something like that. Um... What can I do with it? Lamps, dynamite... Hmm. Table saw. I, I have no idea what this is, does, but I can cut material into slates. Um, sure. Let's build it. And I'm running low on iron. Uh, I'm gonna need room for this. 
Alright, I'm building you there. We can cut wood into coral planks. Oh, no, no, no. We can cut wood into planks. But what are the planks for? Alright, but I need a electricity generator. Gold bar. I don't have to fuel it? That's cool. Awesome. I have a plank. Can I put it anywhere? No. Can I use it at my carpentry bench? Where's my carpentry bench? Is that it? All right, well, I got planks. What do I do with the planks? I haven't the foggiest idea. I probably have to um, get the next tier of ore first. The next thing on my agenda would be grab these ingots. Um, a... Oh god, where is it? A scarlet workbench. That's what I need. But I need scarlet bars. Okay, so we'll have to go beyond the wall. Find some scarlet ore. Get some scarlet bars. And continue on our journey. Well, that was the hive mother. That was, um... Uh, a good challenge, not too difficult, but um, a little easier than I was expecting. I kind of was expecting to die. Uh, the I think the issue was um, last time I tried to fight the Hive Mother, I was getting damaged uh, so much, and um, I realized that I was taking a lot of damage because my armor had broken even before I got to the Hive Mother. So I was just taking tons of damage. And uh, this time the the acid it didn't really do a whole lot of damage. Let's put away our plank. So um, yeah we did it a lot better that time. Put our hive mother chest down. Just uh, cleaning out our inventory a little bit. I'll keep the shovel on me just in case. Uh, we got two hand mortars. I don't need both of them. All right. Now I do have a little bit of time left. We can just go out to the wall and see what's there. Yeah, why not? Let's just go north. Alright, well, here we are at the wall. And as we approach it, it glows. I should place my hand on the wall. Press E. And it just drops into the ground. All right, looks like we need a bridge. Where are we? Uh, 
Aha. Good thing we brought all those bridges. First things first. Uh, Azos? Azos is a wilderness. I got some glow bugs. I wonder if I just release those in my base, will they just uh, stick around? Alright. Let's uh, look around a little bit. Ooh, that's what I want. Scarlet ore, yes. And it's easier to break than the uh, larva walls. Hard thorn. Uh, valuable? Really? Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna need a lot of this ore. Okay, so far, no enemies. It's been pretty peaceful. Let's uh, do some fishing. Blue Cave Guppy. We found one of those in the earlier biomes. Can we find something new? Orange cave guppy. It's worse than the blue cave guppy. Okay. Well, we'll do some more fishing later. I'm betting uh, a lot of the best potions and food items can only be made through ingredients that you find through fishing. Let's try this. Bite it. I know your pattern. Gem crab. Hey. Got ancient gemstones all over it. That's interesting. Okay, so I never noticed this before, but they are... Uh, they are color-coded. This is blue. This is white. So white must be, like, common... Uh, items. Blue is, like, rare. Something like this. Purple is, like... More rare. Or uncommon and then rare, something like that. So we'll cook it later and see what uh, what kind of bonuses it gives us. I'll probably do a lot of fishing off camera because it's not, you know, interesting to watch. And I do want to level up my fishing skill. But right now... I need... More ore. Should 
shiny bits. Oh, there's a pond. Is that wheat? New uh, food item. Bloat oat. Okay, cool. So we can make some new food. Oh, there's got to be some good fishes in this lake. Let's uh, go around. So far, no enemies, though. Which is a little... Unsettling. Okay, that's a big lake. Oh, there's some yellow down there. Let's uh, see what that is. What are you? Uh, did you give me anything? 32... It dropped 32 something. I thought I did. Mm, I don't know. All right, we're running out of bridges. Well, the music got all pleasant. That's nice. Okay, there's a baddie. He just looks like a regular cave... dude. Caveling? There's a farm over there. Right up there. Okay, I'm gonna go say hi. I'm just coming to say hi. Please don't attack me. I am a friend. No. Are you trapped? Can't get out. Alright, I mean... I didn't want to fight you, but... I'm, I'm sorry. Why would you trap yourself like that? Alright, I want these. Ah, no. I'm trapped. Oh, God. Those were like Venus fly traps. Let me shoot it. No. Okay, we'll stay away from those. How about this? Nothing. All right. Well, these are dropping some kind of seeds. Pepper seed. 
I don't know what kind of seeds those are. Glow tulip. But they're not glow tulips. Weird. I mean, I guess it's kind of glowing. I don't know. Well, this guy, he was living alone in his farm. And I killed him. I don't feel good about it, but I don't feel too bad. He's got a gun. Luckily, it's a flintlock. And takes forever to reload. Ooh, what is that? I want it. What do I drop? I don't need the hunting spear, but I can disassemble it. Glow tulips. Don't need it. Puffingy seed. that only grows in mold. What is mold? Is this mold? Earth wall. Moss. Okay, that's... The moss must be where the, um... What causes these guys to spawn. I don't need that. I don't need that. What's the other thing? Low tulip. Okay. Alright, well... How much ore we got? 25. Not bad. Alright, I'm gonna head back. I want this thing. That's a butterfly. Come back here. It has bright colors irritating to the naked eye. How could a color, a specific color, be irritating? I guess it's just so bright. Alright, well, I think I'm going to head back. Okay, now I'm starting to see enemies. Luckily, they've got silly little flintlock pistols. Um, I'm going to head back, smelt this ore, and uh, see what we can build next.